Hello Virgo, welcome to the channel. Hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Please remember this is a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. Take what resonates or look at your moon and rising sign for greater clarity. Okay. We have breaking trail. A break breakthrough is at hand. So you can see I'm working hard here and you're going to get that lucky break that you're needing or the answers are going to come through or you're going to see the way forward here. Fellow travellers, support all around you. Support is all around you. So there's people around you that could support you at this time as well. You could be part of a team here that's working towards something. Or it could be your soul tribe, your friends, your family that are supporting you just now. Answering the call, the time is now. Now this is the time to be, that breakthrough is going to come. It's the time to go through that and it's going to enable you. I think you could even be wrapping things up here to go into a new beginning. She's going through a new door. But this is the right time here. Um, you're going to get a breakthrough. A new job could come forward. A new opportunity of any kind could come forward. So if you've been trying to achieve something here, it looks like it's just about to come to fruition. Let's see. Let's see what the tarot says. The Seven of Wands, and that's a determination card. The Tower card. The Ten of Cups. The beautiful Star card, which comes after the Tower card. The Knight of Pentacles. The Two of Wands. The Strength card. Now, you could be dealing with a Leo or somebody with Leo in their chart. The Seven of Cups. And the hanged man. Now there's a tower moment here. Now a tower moment is anything you consider a tower moment to be. It will be different for everybody. This tower moment is designed to release you from things. So if you've been stuck in something and not been able to move out of it, you've been in there for a long time. This is the man, he's hanging in limbo here. The universe has stepped in and they've made They've put an end to things. So anything unstable or anyone unstable or anything that's not going to progress in your life has been removed. And this can feel like the rug's been pulled from under your feet. It can take you off guard. But everything is changing as you know it. It's, it's, it can feel like everything's falling away. It could be that you're feeling you're stuck in this energy or you're being stuck. The universe held you in this tower so that you could learn things. You could gain experience in life, whatever this tower moment is for you. He's gave up the power of his arms and legs so that he can, sometimes you see him in the other tarot deck, the traditional tarot deck, hanging from the tree of knowledge. So you've gained a lot of knowledge and you will recover from this because there's light bulb moments that can come in and you suddenly get the clarity you need. And now's the time you're going to get this clarity and it's going to move you forward. Now there's support networks around you. There'll be people around you that can support you. Spirit is supporting you. Always remember that. But there's a breakthrough moment coming. You're going to start to see that this has been a blessing in disguise. You're going to heal from this. There's support networks around you to help support you at this time to heal. This is new hope and rejuvenation, and that's what tower moments are about. They're blessings in disguise so that you can gain enlightenment and you can decide how to go forward. And the breakthrough's coming. Now, it could be in the form of news. It could be enlightenment. You're starting to see the beauty in this. So you're going to recover from this and heal. You're going to come into your own again. And you're going to see the way forward, most definitely. The time is now. It can be that you're seeing it now, or it can be that now is the time for the tower moment. It's a destined time. So they're saying you will see the way forward. Definitely. It can be that there's something that you've been involved in here that you need to make a decision about. And it's going to cause a tower moment in your life. It's going to be very up, it's going to, there's going to be a lot of upheaval through what it is that you're deciding to do here. You're getting it. You're thinking, this is what I need to do. So this could cause a lot of upset in your life. But they're starting off here by realising that you're going to be determined to do this. This is a card of determination. You've learned enough. Like I say, he's learned enough. These are karmic lessons. You're learning to stand your ground. You're learning to speak up. You're learning to be determined to go towards what it is you want. You've got the upper hand here. So the breakthrough moment is coming. It could be you standing up for yourself. It could be you speaking up for yourself. But the overall energy is about you moving forward. Now, it could be courage that you're having to show. You might have to show courage here. Now, always remember, 
that you're more courageous than you give yourself credit for, most definitely. If you think about everything you've been through and you've survived, that's where your confidence can come from. She's very confident. She's standing beside a lion. She's very determined. She's healed from her experiences. She's grown from her experiences and she becomes strong again and she's ready to move forward and she's ready to stand up for herself. So now's the time to be courageous. Now's the time to go forward. Now's the time you'll have that breakthrough to speak up, stand your ground. And it's read, you're ready to move. Now, it might take a wee while. You might want to plan your way forward. Look at the details of things. Take time. Don't take risks. This Knight of Pentacles, he's somebody who doesn't take risks. I'm saying he, it's not a gender specific reading. He looks at the details of things. If he's signing up for things, contracts, anything legal, he dots his I's and strokes his T's. He plans his way forward here. Um, he decides his path and he takes his time and baby steps. Baby steps is what he takes. And that's the beauty of the success because he lays a solid foundation. He's very sure of himself by the time he goes forward. He's on a steady footing to go down his new path that he's choosing for himself. After recovering, there's new hope rejuvenation. Listen to your intuition here because you're going to have to make choices. Choose your choices about which path to go down. Plan it. Think about it. Research it. Do whatever you need to do. Take a step back and heal and then make the decision. But take your time to get yourself onto an even keel again. Um, things will be restored, definitely. And there's lots of blessings waiting for you. You will be rewarded. There's options. We always have options in life. We're never stuck with something. We don't have to be stuck with anybody or in anything in life. So if you're strong, you'll see the blessings. You'll start to see the blessings in this tower moment. Like I say, the enlightenment, you'll come forward. You'll listen to your intuition and you'll be able to see the path you want to go down here. And there's lots of blessings here. There's choices. You have choices in life. We all have choices. We don't have to be stuck with anything. And we can move forward towards greater stability. And from that, we will get or you will get lots of blessings. Now, blessings are at the end of a rainbow here. So you can't claim these blessings unless you have been through tower moments or challenges of some description. So there's a tower moment here. It's about being determined to speak up, stand your ground, go forward with determination towards what is going to you consider your blessings. You will be rewarded for this. It's about making plans to choose your new path and healing from this tower moment starting to heal and be rejuvenated. There's support networks around you, family, friends, soul tribe type energies, but you're, and spirit. So you're making your plans and you're choosing your path, how you're going to go forward here. It's about showing courage. You've learned your lessons. You've been stuck in this place, but now you're starting to see the beauty in the tower moment. You're starting to see your way forward here and you're ready to go towards your blessings, uh, most definitely. And now is the time to be strong. Now is the time to go forward. Com compassion. Compassion. When you show greater compassion towards yourself, the universe automatically responds by showering you with greater blessings. That's what I'm saying. So this is healing rejuvenation. This had to happen. It's divine timing. Don't beat yourself up about your choices, about what's happened. It's so you can heal and you can move on and you can make more stable choices for yourself in the future. Okay, I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.